morning guys and welcome back to you me and the family I've got a couple of shopping hauls here that aren't very big so I've combined them the husband and I have done a bit of shopping and we went to B&M the range the pound stretcher and the pound shop so I've got it all on the table but in its own sections so I'll take you round the table what I got from each of the shops we'll start over by the smallest haul which was the range we had to go in there because I was looking for some lino because the kittens are moving about now and they're now potty training and making a bit of a mess so they're in their crate and they needed some wipeable liners and in the end we found these tablecloths which are fantastic instead they were reduced to 379 and I got three packets of them so they'll do the job so they're easy to wipe off and clean and keep sanitized my husband picked up this wash mitt it's a three-in-one wash mitt because he does like to take pride in the car he picked up some Haribo Tangtastic or Tang Fasties no Tang Fastics that's it him and the baby like to eat them and then I picked up some fountain filters for the cat's water fountain that needed replacing so I got them so again it was only a little haul from the range but in the range all that lot came to £21 85p believe it or not that's near on double what I spent in the other two shops so we'll slide across the table and this little haul is from the pound stretcher we got two of these fab fresh mousses carpet and upholstery cleaning one is linen fresh oh and I've just realized this isn't a carpet cleaner this one is a glass cleaner so that's a mousse as well that is lem lemon fragrance so I made a bit of a balls up there with them I picked up Chloe some pretzels I thought the kids would like to try this, these mini cheddars in blue cheese flavour. I picked up two packets of lemon fragrance antibacterial wipes. Again, for cleaning the tablecloths that I got there for the kittens. So that will keep them all clean. The husband picked up these Nest Cafe Latte sachets I think they're for work and then I picked up these white Twixes they are gorgeous lovely a nice little treat for me when I need it and then the husband went a bit mad on the biscuits he picked up some Jammy Dodgers cherry burst flavor and then array an array of custard cream flavors so he's got a normal custard cream a lemon cream a chocolate cream and then an orange cream and as you can see he's already started on them but I had to stop him so that I could record the video so those few bits there that wasn't a whole lot they came to let's find my receipt £14.60 I'll tell you prices of items are going right up now aren't they right I'll put them down so I can show you at the back the pound shop haul I tried to have a good look round but there wasn't much that was grabbing my attention so I just grabbed a few little treaty bits Chloe wants to make some brownies and these packets at the moment are down to a pound so I picked her up three packets of the tempting chocolate brownie mix here's the three packets and all you have to do is add an egg some oil and a bit of water so that's good for her and I got two packets of the Betty Crocker's gooey chocolate chip cookies again all you need to do is add water and butter to them so they'll be good for her to do I picked up two packets of four of these hello pandas these are a nice little treat believe it or not the box is a waste because the packet is really quite small but they are lovely they're little biscuits with um, 
a soft chocolate filling. I got them for the kids for a nice little treat. I got these. I've not seen these before, but the skinny the skinny company keep bringing out loads of different varieties of these treats. They are the fruit and nut chocolate crunch. So I thought they'd be a nice little treat. If anyone can recommend any other skinny type bars, please put them in the comments and I'll give them a try for you. And then I got two packets of there's three in a pack here of the fruity biscuit shots. They're a nice little treat. The husband picked up this snow foam car shampoo from the pound shop. He likes to try all these new car products that he sees. Every shop he tries to go and pick something up. And then at the back, I got two packets of five in a pack of these yogurt coated raisins. They're for Chloe for her pack lunches. And then at the bottom, I picked up two packets of the Nesquik cereal bars and you get six in a pack there. So all of that from the pound shop came to £16, which you can't really see now because I've laid it all down. I've, des I've destroyed my display, which isn't very good, is it? I'm trying to show you everything and I'll make more of a mess. There we go. There's a bit of it. So that came to £16 and then if I move you over to the other side of the table, this is the bigger haul of the lot. This is all from B&M. Where shall I start? Shall we start at the back? We'll start with all the boring household bits. I picked up this exo exotic bloom fabric conditioner and the big mega pack of the Lenore exotic bloom scent boosters. And then I picked up the Exotic Bloom washing tabs as well. I picked up the Lemon Fragrance Fabulous dishwasher tablets. A washing machine cleaner. I keep seeing these going around on little short videos. I can't find the toilet cleaner this company does that I keep seeing people popping down the toilet and it fizzes right up if you can tell me which one it is please write it in the comments I want to find it and I've been looking in home bargains and b and um, I've picked up two packets of the Febreze bathroom um, air fresheners we've got the what fragrance is that sparkle bloom and the red cherry blossom I'm trying to put these in every room rather than the plugins. I know the plugins don't use a whole lot of electricity, but as you all know, bills are going up, so I'm trying not to use the plugins anymore. So if anyone can recommend a nice fragrance as well of the um of these, <laughs> please write that in the comments and I'll give them a whirl as well. I'm having to put two in my son's bedroom at the at the moment as well, being a smelly teenager. We've got down here. We've got dishwasher salt, some blue foam aroma that goes down the toilet. That's similar to what I'm looking for, but it doesn't foam up as much. But this does really leave your bathroom smelling gorgeous. So I, I would recommend this this product for anyone that wants to try. The husband picked up some Demon Shine Spray and Shine Car Cleaner. And I think that is all the household items, like cleaning products and everything. And we'll move down to some food products that I got. I picked up two packets of these Canopas. There's five in a pack. But didn't make sense because there were five for a pound. And then there were other packets of the Canopas. Sorry, a glare there. Four in a pack for a pound. So that didn't really make sense, so I got the five. There's two packets there. Again, a staple in this family. I got the brunch bars. I got two of the chocolate chip. And then two of the raisin. That's to go in the kids' pack lunches. I got a pack of eight of the chocolate squares. They were two pounds. 
and then I got a pack of six of the chocolate filled crepes that's for breakfast on the weekend for a nice little treat they have that with some fruit I found two packets of these I haven't tried these before but I thought the kids would like them Nutella biscuits they've got they look like they've got nice runny chocolate in the middle so I'm hoping they'll be a nice treat for them it says new on them so if you haven't seen them maybe you should go to B&M and try and pick some up so there was two packets of them there's the other pack the husband just food finished off this Mayflower Chinese style curry sauce this is all the rave at the moment I tell you it's gorgeous you buy fish and chips and then just make up some of this to go with it lovely I picked up two packets of 14 of the Red Leicester mini cheddars we used to like just the normal mini cheddars until someone suggested the Red Leicester and the kids have swapped they prefer this flavour to the normal so I picked up them again Chloe I picked up a packet of this Nesquik because that's for her Ensures everywhere I've seen it it's £4 a tub at B&M at the moment it's £2.50 so that's a big save in there and then I picked up two tins of chicken and white sauce for the chicken, the kids pasta that they take in their pat lunches and then oh sorry let me drop the camera then I picked up these sours I fancy the, the sound of them so I thought I would um, get them and have a little try of them We've got the passion fruit and the raspberry. If I don't like them in just the shot as they are, I think they'd be very nice in um, a base of a J2O or something. So it's a nice fruity drink to have in the summer with some ice, which will be nice. And then what else have we got? Right, we're going to slide down here, hidden underneath the Nutella. Something Chloe liked the look of. A giant... Million, millions duo fashion lolly it's like duo fusion lolly that's what she chose it's raspberry and bubble gum I wonder how long that's going to last her and then we picked up some hairbands I had to get different coloured hairbands because now that the kittens are getting bigger and I've got another litter due they all look the same because their fur is changing to the colour so at the moment they all need a different colour so that I can keep records of their weights and how well they're progressing. Because I don't always give them names before they go to their new homes. So they get colour coded in the diary and then I can maintain their progression in weight. So that's them. Had to pick up some children's Pyroton because while we was out yesterday I had a phone call from the school. Hayley had come up in a rash on her back. Um, it looked like a prickly heat rash so they gave us some Pyroton for me until I got home but then when we looked it was lines across her back which I've never come across um, I've googled it and it says nothing to worry about it will go on its own um, but she's never she's never really suffered with heat rash and yesterday wasn't very hot at all so I don't know why or what has caused it but if it doesn't go down the next couple of days I have to take her to the doctors so we had to pick that up and then last but not least right at the back I'll pick it up and bring it over we had to pick up some new toys for Nathan to have at his nans because because he's getting old he's getting 19 months baby toys aren't what he's liking no more he's liking cars so we picked up this box for six pounds just for him to have to play at his, uh, his nannies and I'll replace the baby toys with them I'll, I'll pass the baby toys onto the charity shop for anyone that needs them so that everyone is everything a big haul the B&M haul I haven't had a chance to tell you has it all this came to £108 oh where's this £108 2p so it does look a lot and it does cost a lot but as you all know the price of inflation is going up and I have got my cleaning products at the back as well and two bottles of alcohol. So if you like this video please hit the like button and if you'd like to be notified when I next upload another video please subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything. 
all you got to do is click on a button and YouTube will tell you when I've uploaded a video. Okay, take care everyone. Hope you enjoy the weather and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.